The office of the Department of Information and Communication is falling apart. Heavy rain in Port Moresby had caused flooding in the office's policy and secretary's office on the second and third floor of the Tropicana building at the Gordon's Industrial Area. Bradley Gregory with this report. This is the office that houses the Foreign Affairs and the Department of Communication and Information. It's the Tropicana building at Gordon's Industrial Area. From outside, you can see evidence of the window frames falling apart. And the water is coming from there. The communication secretary, Polius Coney, had extra work to do covering his office floor with newspaper. So that's the final. And it's gone down to the corporate services division, where our finance and administration now hub of the uh, administration is. So I don't know the extent of the damage downstairs, but uh, as you can see, there's water all over, which is the uh, uh, evidence of leakage across this building. Secretary Connie says issues relating to the building's standards have been raised before. I think we really have to make sure that uh, uh, you know, operators that put up buildings and structures in our cities and towns and for, you know, offices to occupy, we must make sure that they comply with the standards. The policy office on the second floor is most affected. Office equipment damaged as a result of the flood. However, the biggest problem yet is the power and phone lines. A person can be electrocuted or the office can be on fire. So I've been working this afternoon to try and clean the mess up and to ensure that uh, it doesn't go through the uh, power mains and probably set the light up here. The constant rain in the city has caused flooding in other parts of the city. Travel in and out of Jackson's airport has also been challenging, with people running in the rain to catch a flight. Bradley Gregory, NBC National News, Port Mosby.